Ruth chapter 2. Ula Naomi mo da alahi tha. Isha gib bora hail. And for Naomi was a known one, a kinsman for her husband, a man, a man of valor or a man of efficiency or of wealth. Mimishapahat Halim Melek from the family of Halim Melek. Ushamor Boaz and his name Boaz. Watohmera Ruth Hamoha Via Eleno Ami Elka Nahashada Wahlakata Bishibolim. Achar atar emetahin be'enayu. And Ruth the Mohavit said to Noami, I would go now to the field and I would glean among the sheaves or the ears, the heads of grain, after whom I would find, after whom I will find favor in his eyes what lucky bitti and she said to her go my daughter what tell what tavo what luck at and she went and she came and she gleaned in the field after the harvesters why yikr mikraha and it happened her happening in the parcel of the field, the portion of the field for Boaz. Boaz. Which was who was from the family of Ali Melek. And behold, Boaz came from the house of the house of bread, which is Bethlehem, the city. Why Yohmer Lakotarim Yahweh Imak Yahweh And he said to the harvesters or reapers, Yahweh is with you. Why Yohmer or Yahweh be with you? Why Yohmeru Lo Why Yohmeru Lo Yavarakukaya? And they said to him, May Yahweh bless you. Why Yohmer Boaz Lenaro? And Boaz said to his man, his servant, Hanithaba al Hakotarim, the one uh, superintending, overseeing over the reapers. Let me Naara Hadot. For whom, whose is this damsel or this lass, this young lady? Why yaran, why yaran han al hakotarim, why yohmer? Naara mohaviyahi hathaba im noami mishade moab. And the lad, the one set over. Uh, answered uh, over the one set over the reapers answered and he said the the lass is a Moabit um, she is the one returning with Noami from the fields of Moab Bogomarim, achare hakotarim, and she said, "I would glean now, and I would gather among the ears, among the sheaves, after the reapers." Hmm. 
and she came and she stood from then the morning and unto now this is her sitting place uh, in the house a little while Why yohmer boaz hel root hello shamat piti al te lakhi lil qot bashad akhir wa gam lo ta'buri mid wa qot id waqin im na'rotai and boaz said to root is it not that thou hast heard my daughter do not go to glean in another field and also neither do not pass from here and thus ye sh uh, thou shalt abide with my maidens in the Enaik Bashad Atariq Sorun. Thy eyes in the field which they reap. Waha Lakti Aharehem Aharehen. And thou shalt go after them. Hallo Hustiwiti et Hanrarim. Levility Noga Ech. Have I not commanded the lads for not to touch thee with Amit Wahalakut El Hakelim Washatit Mehatar Yishahabun Han Arim? And should thou thirst, thou shalt go to the vessels. And thou shalt drink from which the lads have drawn, drawn like from the well. What And she fell on her face. What And she worshipped to the ground. She prostrated herself. What Elau Madu Matati Hen Benerka Lahaki Reni Wa Noki Nokria. And she said to him, Why have I found favor in thy eyes? For thy recognizing me, and I am a foreigner. Wa Yaran Boaz. Why Yohmer Allah? And Boaz answered and he said to her, Who gather who God the Lee? Call at Rashit et Hamotek, Achre Mote he shake. Narratingly, it hath been narrated to me all which thou hast effectuated with thy mother in law. After the death of thy man, what ta'azavu, what ta'azavi abik, we him make, we herish more la the take, what te lucky el am utter aloh ya dat to more philosom. Thank you, my wife. Thank you very much. You lovely. Sorry, that thank you, my wife bit wasn't in there. Boaz says to Ruth, Thou hast forsaken thy father and thy mother and the land of thy begettings, and thou hast gone to a people which thou hast not known. Thou hast not known them yesterday or two days ago, hast not known them before. And that's this is like Abraham even. Remember Yahweh said to Abraham, Go from your family and from your your people to a land that 
I will show you. Here, Ruth has left her family, her people, her gods, and has come to um, the land of Noami's God, and has come to her God and seeks the protection of her God and seeks to be a person belonging to the God of Yisrael the true God and every one of us is to do that now Yahweh is calling everyone the creator the God of Israel is calling everyone to come to him and be saved by him and be surrendered to him and to learn his ways and to do them be enrolled he is calling you into the one body of Yeshua. He is calling all peoples everywhere. No matter what your background, there's no more any excuse. Yahweh has revealed himself. He has revealed himself through Yeshua, his son. There was not a man like him, obedient to God in everything. Hear Yahweh's truth and respond appropriately. This is obedient faith. This is the faith that saves. Obedient faith. Be the one body of Yeshua. Send me a message. And let's be connected in true accountability and purity. Let Yahweh repay thy deed. And let thy wage be shalema, complete, me'im Yahweh, from Yahweh Elohe Yisrael, the God of Yisrael. This is what he says to Ruth. At rabat lahazot tahat knafayu, which thou hast come to take refuge under his wings. What Tomer Emetah Hen Beenoka Adoni Ki Nehamatani. And she said, Let me find favor in thy eyes, my Lord, for thou hast comforted me. Wiki dib barata ala lib shifahate shifahaterka. And as thou hast worded on upon the heart of thy maid servant, Waha no ki lo eha yerka ahata shifahaterha. And I, I am not like one of your maid servants, like one of thy maid servants. Wa yo merlah boaz. And he said to her, Boaz, Boaz said to her at the time of the eating, Draw near here, and thou shalt eat from the bread and thou shalt dip thy morsel in the vinegar and she sat beside the reapers and he extended to her um, roasted grain he reached out roasted grain to her and she ate and she was satisfied and there was remaining and she made remain she left some over and she arose to glean and Boaz commanded his men Lemor saying, Gama ben haramarim telaket, Velo hatahali muha. 
also between the sheaves let her glean and do not embarrass her or reproach her humiliate her don't wagama sholata sholu wagama sholata sholu la and also this is interesting draw out drawing out thou ye shall draw out for her min hastavatim from the bundles wa azabtam lil waliqtah walah tiga aruba you shall draw out from the bundles and you shall leave you you shall leave and she shall glean and you shall not rebuke her what luck at bashada adharib and she gleaned in the field until the evening what tahabot at atar liqata and she beat what she had gleaned why yahya kafa shu'urim and there was like an efa of shu'urim of bali what tisha what tisha watabur and she she lifted and she came to the city what ter hamota and her mother mother-in-law saw at the utter liqata what she had gleaned what to she what titanala and she brought out she brought out and she gave to her at the utter hotira mishaba what she had left over from her um satiety from her having enough what to her hamota a for lekat hayom wahana ashit yahi makirek baruk and she said to her that's Noami said to Ruth, uh, Hamota, the her mother-in-law said to her, "Where hast thou gathered today, and where effectuated thou? Let the one that has recognized you, recognized thee, be blessed." What tugged the Hamota? And she narrated to her mother-in-law, "At the utter ashata in more, what what she effectuated with him, with it, uh, who she had effectuated with him, probably. What tohmer shema haish utter ashita in more hayom." Boaz, and she said, "The name of the man which I effectuated or worked with him today is Boaz." What Tohmer Noami lekalata, and Noami said to her daughter-in-law, "Baruch hu haleyah." Let him be blessed for uh, by Yah. Atar, atar lo azab hasdo et hahayim we et hameti, which hath not, which hath not forsook his loving kindness with the living and with the dead. What tohmer la noami, noami said to her, karov la nu hahish mi gohlenu hu. The man is near to us, from from our redeemers. From our redeemers, he is our near kinsman. 
Watohamaro root Hamohavia Gamma Kiha Marhe Lai Em Hanarim Atarali Tidba Kane Adahim Kilu et Kol Hakatir Atarali And Ruth said, Ruth the Moavit said, also that he said to me with the lads which are with my with me which are mine cleave thou until until all the harvest which is mine is finished what tohmer noami el rut kalata Noemi said to Ruth, her, her daughter-in-law, Tov viti ki te shahi em na'arotaiw, v'lo ha yifiga ovach b'shad acher. It is good, my daughter, that thou goest out with his maidens, and that no one, no man, Approach thee in another field. What did the buck bena wrote the boaz lelaket? And she she stuck close among the maidens of Boaz to glean. Ad kalot kasir hash orim u kasir hahitim. Until the the end, the finishing of the harvest of the barley, and the harvest of the wheat, what tethab at the hamota, and she dwelt with her mother-in-law. And here endeth chapter two of Ruth. Thanks for listening, Yahweh bless you. Take heed of the word of Yahweh.